Greetings from the 41st floor of the Meridian Hotel in Shanghai, I think. I wanted to do a horn quartet. So here is Im Schönsten Wiesengrunde, Meadow Most Beautiful, which is the most appropriate thing I could think of for Shanghai, conducted by Moi Mini Conducting. <laughs> I want to answer the question of why did I do that? Why did I spend an hour tonight multi-tracking a horn quartet when I'm on tour with San Francisco Symphony? Well, today was a free day, and tomorrow is a Bruckner 7 performance. And I find that it's important for me not just to keep up my fundamental skills, but also to keep up my ensemble skills, kind of especially on free days when it can slide a little bit. And what I want to be doing is amping up especially for something like Bruckner, where playing in a choir is super important. Blending, understanding the role that you're playing, knowing what chord member you have, all that stuff. In addition to that, I really enjoy multi-tracking, especially with a conductor track instead of a click track, because it helps me practice responding to a conductor. It helps me figure out how my gestures actually translate to sound. And uh, it just gives me a chance to listen and to practice, to deliberately practice fitting in somewhere. I can screw up as many times as I want and I can improve a little bit. I hear, oh, I'm a little late on these low notes or oh, my thirds are a little bit high or something like that. It's, it's a really useful thing to do if you wanna be a good symphonic player or a neurosymphonic, which is what I do. So if you want to find out more about that or about what I do synergistic practice-wise, visit my website, markgelfo.com, or start following my posts and like my artist page at facebook.com forward slash practice living music. Happy multi-tracking! <laughs>